Hello YouTube, this is your boy Texo back from Texo Channel and today I got a new video for you guys. So this is some huge news coming out of Cricket Wireless. They've released a press release today, um, October 29th, 2021. And essentially here, Cricket Wireless has reached 12.4 million subscribers. So this is a huge milestone for Cricket Wireless. You know, they've reached 12.4 million subscribers. And along with that, they've also updated all of their plans. So the $60 plan, the $55 entry unlimited plan, the $30 plan and $40 plan all got upgraded. So the, 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 the main focus of this video here is to talk about the three plans, the 30, 40 and the entry $55 unlimited plan. Because with those plans, there was a speed restriction. You were capped at eight megabits. At a point in time too, it was capped at three megabits and it went back to eight megabits. But as of today, those plans do not have the eight megabits per second speed cap. So, um, whatever phone you have, um, as of today, you should notice that your speeds are no longer capped at eight megabits per second. Another, uh, very, very huge thing I like about this, uh, from Cricket is the fact that you also have nationwide 5G access on all of those plans. And not only do you have the nationwide 5G access, which is the low band 5G access, you do also get 5G plus, which is AT&T's millimeter wave. And I do believe if I'm not mistaken, those three plans will also get access to C band. So the reason why I'm talking about this is because in previous, um, you know, days, um, you were only able to get the fastest available speed on the Cricket More plan, which is the $60 unlimited plan. So now that they have actually upgraded this to give you you know, access to all the networks and, you know, um, the, the, the speeds are not capped. This is huge. With Metro by T-Mobile, of course, they were coming at Cricket and saying save half. Like if you dish Cricket, you will save half. So basically, you'd be paying, you know, $25 a month. You have all 5G access. And also, too, um, if you didn't want to even do that, you wanted to just go to Metro by T-Mobile and get any of the plans, you would have 5G included. So this is a great response from Cricket to include 5G in all their plans. Um, one thing I do wish they did uh, in terms of the $60 plan is that I wish that they added HD video streaming. Uh, with the $60 plan, it's still, uh, you know, uh, restricted to just standard definition 480p but one uh, thing i want to talk about the 60 dollar plan it does look like uh the 60 dollar plan has actually gotten some postpaid like priority because if you look here it says premium data that won't slow based on your data usage so there's no like uh indicator on like how much gigabytes party usage do you like you know get uh, I know with AT&T postpaid with the Elite plan before the change was made recently, you were getting 100 gigabyte of uh, priority data. I'm not sure with the you know um, Cricket um, side if if that's the case, but um, it does look like it's going to be really good. I actually have a tweet here um, from Best MVNO where they actually got an update from a Cricket Wireless representative that has confirmed that the data speeds will no longer be slowed on the $60 plan when the network is busy. So essentially what that states is if you're in an area that is congested um, and of course a lot of folks and you know the network is busy, you will not be slowed down. You would actually have priority access. So this is actually good. I think there's still um, certain things that might be, you know, um, still going on because, um, you know, of course it's prepaid and then turning it on, you know, detail here, but I do believe with this plan, essentially what the $60 would basically differentiate is the fact that it won't actually have management, you know, uh, 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 like restrictions or like things going on compared to like the $55 plan. So that's good. And of course with the 50, I mean, with the $60 plan, you do get the hotspot HBO max, even though it comes with as in that 150, uh, gigabyte cloud storage. But I think this is a great move from quick wireless, of course, with the, you know, prepaid, uh, you know, market right now with all the, you know, companies competition to try to offer the best, you know, value for your buck. I think this is huge for um, AT&T, you know, offering this for Cricket Wireless. Of course, they're consolidating like, well, like I would say consolidating, but like, yeah, migrating over the AT&T prepay brand to Cricket Wireless. So like I said, I think the only thing that you really need to focus now is just kind of upgrading that, you know, video streaming quality to at least 720p. I would love to see 1080p, but at least upgrading that video streaming, you know, from standard definition to high definition, I think that would be really great. 
But yeah, this is some great news from Cricket Wireless. I'm glad they made this response to Metro by T-Mobile, you know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, it's you, the consumer, that's going to benefit from all of this. So I think this is great for prepaid, um, kind of getting, you know, closer in terms of like closing the gap between postpaid and prepaid. So this is all good for us, the consumer. So if you like this video, please leave a like, comment, and, you know, share this video if you like. Um, this has been Tangzo from Tangzo Channel, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Thank you.